welcome back to our channel we are back with another fun film challenge cameron here and gonna tell you all about this homemade jib rig this challenge also inspired by my grad school education um learning how to create a moving camera shot using innovative kind of janky <laughs> practices a jib is basically a piece of equipment that helps create lift in a shot so you know if you want to do one of those shots where the camera's like booming starting really low and booming up and kind of revealing or showing a space something like that that's something that a jib would do so i was like how can i make this out of like household materials so um i was like i can i should be able to use a broom and some kind of lever system and attach the camera to the end. Of course, I didn't really know how I was gonna do this. So the first iteration of this was putting a chair inside of my wagon from Costco and gaff taping the end of the broom to the top of the chair. So in order for this to work, I would need to have um, put counterweights on on both sides so that when I'm booming up or down with the with the pole which is the broom in this case um that it would be balanced and that it wouldn't tip over so i experimented i put <laughs> i put i got a wegman's grocery bag filled it with like flour a thing of soap hands uh dish soap uh and then on the other end i took this like decor element um that i had and i gaff taped that to the other end yeah okay so i moved on from the chair because that was not working um so I figured let me use this kind of almost it was kind of it was like a v-shape kind of like a valley kind of thing on the top of the tripod with when i took the base plate off so i'm using that and putting the weights on either side trying to push it up and down and making sure it gets to a place where it can kind of stand almost hands-free hey guys so we just did the shots i know i couldn't record myself doing it because it's on my phone but I'm going to show you what we got and I just um, had to take my phone off so I <laughs> so you can see this was a <laughs> it was a, an, an experiment for sure um, here's the other side this is the other weight and that's the wagon right over there all right so here are the shots so I'm starting from this top angle and I'm trying to boom down as smoothly as possible um, with this jib to get to the couch. I think it's working pretty nicely, honestly. Yeah, so this one also starting low um, and going upwards. A little shaky, but it's working. And I was able to get it to be so smooth because of the weights, uh, the counterweights on, on either side. Uh, without it, it would have been like really shaky. So the previous iterations that I worked on was trying to attach it to a C-stand and that didn't work because it clamped the broom so there was no way for it wasn't a lever so there was no way for me to tilt it up and down so here's me talking a little bit more about that okay hi guys so that didn't really work how i expected it to work so i'm gonna set up another c stand and try to make it like we'll see <laughs> I'm kind of up against the clock because the camera's all taped up, but the battery only has like one cell in the thing left. So I'm like, oh no. <laughs> Alrighty. Um, ah, okay.
Okay, and we're starting out in the kitchen. Uh, yeah, as you can see, there was a lot of tilt. There was no way to control it from going side to side, but I did get this really kind of cool shot of this like tilty kind of push in that I really liked. Like that was really cool and I would do it again if that was what I was going for. Um, I would try it again and like, you know, try to make it even smoother or make it even longer because that was kind of cool, kind of reminded me of those like TikTok uh, cooks. <laughs> but yeah, so that was my innovative camera process uh, and project. Let us know what you think in the comments below and also go ahead and try to make your own homemade rig of sorts. Uh, be safe. Safety is the number one concern. Don't do anything uh, where you might injure yourself or any actors or any property or drop the camera, injure the equipment, um, things like that. Be safe and mindful about that and enjoy. All right. Thanks, guys. We'll see you in the next video.